Whoa, man. What the hell, man? Is that Cleopatra? Is that Cleopatra from SpongeBob, bro? I'm gonna give this bitch a kiss. Hold up. <laughs> Welcome back, 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 welcome. Today we're playing a game called Chain. Chronological Haunted Anomalies Interconnecting Narrative. So I don't know if you guys ever played that game Telephone when you were a kid, where you would say one phrase and then whisper it down the line and see what it ended up being. But it's that, but with video games. Harold Brind is eel. And then you had to whisper it. Harold Brind is eel. Harold Brind is eel. Harold Brind is real. <laughs> And then, you know, you'd get to the end and you guys would say it out. And, ah, funny. The Chain is an exquisite corpse collection of over 20 short horror games developed over the span of half a year. The developers could not communicate with each other during the development. Each developer would send their game to the next person in line who would make a follow-up. Together, they form a complete narrative. It's like the coolest idea ever to me. I, I couldn't pass this one up. So, fuck it. Let's ball. Let's do it. Chain. The Haunted PS1 Presents. Apparently it's it's big spooky, so I, I wore my big boy pants. Okay. Okay, so this one was started December 2023. Wait, no, that doesn't make any sense. What? <laughs> Whoa, this is cool. Look, you can look through the notes and stuff, like about it. The little hands, the little PNG hands. It's rated S for spooky. All right, let's do it. Play. Did it crash? Oh no, okay, okay, that was the launcher. Okay, we're in, the first game. What? <laughs> what? Where am I, where am I? So this first game's called Torch. All right, let's go explore. I wanna, I wanna get a, a hold of this narrative here. Wow, where am I? I'm in some sort of catacombs. Got the PS1 titties and everything, bruh. Look at them things, man. Oh, okay. I'm not really sure yet. I'm just, I'm just wandering around. Huh? That shadow keeps freaking me out though. Hello? Is anybody here? It's gotta be what the Queen of England's coochie looks like, bruh. <laughs> Just deep, dark, long stone hallways. <laughs> Where's the fucking spooky man? Walk around with this goddamn matchstick for the last three minutes. Oh, shit! What was that? Hello? Okay, that was it. So far in the story, we have trapezoid titties, we were stuck in some giant maze, and uh, we had a torch. We have to remember, this is somehow connected to this. The guy who made this game was sent the last game and had no context. Do y'all ever do that thing when your PS1 discs, PS2 discs got scratched up where you'd rub them in toothpaste? I can't be the only one. Whoa. Okay, this is directly after the last game. To the big f white light. Okay, we're the same lady who I'm assuming is Miss Blanc. Hey, mister, do you know what the f*** is going on? <laughs> ah, Miss Blanc, glad to see you've made it this far. My apologies for us having to meet in this way. I'm sure you understand that these circumstances required a more elaborate route. I'm sure you're pleased to hear that two of the other participants have made it beyond this point. That's right, this isn't quite the end of the road yet. Do you know what beach we're on, Miss Blanc? Uh, no f clue, my guy. You'll find that this beach, in a certain way, doesn't really exist. In fact, after you step through the gate, you were transported to a place that's personal to you. So this beach has some sort of significance to me. It does all feel rather familiar, doesn't it? I can't see his face, he turns to me. I don't think you're going to need that torch, I assure you. Stick close to me and hold your breath and you'll be fine. <laughs> returning home these people need him goodbye sir every japanese guy who works a 90 hour work week for 30 years straight hey, are you sure I, we're just going into the ocean what the fuck bro it looks like i'm holding that dildo that b from the cheerio thing be using bro wait what is where are you taking me mister how, how much longer do, do we have jesus christ this is spooky i don't like ocean shit man what do you hear that what is that? Is that a whale? I don't know how much further we can go, big guy. Holy shit, how no, we can go further. Wow, we were really going for it, huh? <laughs> this is fucking crazy. What? I swear to God, if there's some sort of spooky sea monster that's gonna come out and eat me, I'm gonna be fucking pissed. What is that? Oh, I see something. Yeah, there's something there. What is that? A rock! 
It's the first thing I've seen in five minutes. Yes, this is awesome. Hey, you sure you know where you're going? Do you come to the bottom of the ocean very often? He just keeps walking. There's rocks down though, so that's kind of spicing things up. What do you call three rocks? Four rocks? What do you call four rocks in one spot? There's got to be a name for that. I like how she's still like daintily holding this torch. Hey, hey, whoa, hey, wait, 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 buddy, buddy. Oh shit, I can't breathe now. Oh, f Oh, what? Some sort of simulation, alternate universe, something. That was a construct of something familiar to me, which was an endless beach, and some guy in a suit led me to the, the bottom of the ocean to look at a his rock collection. Next game, I guess. The Participants. Far into the sea, or high in the clouds, it is a strange place I have found. Uh, myself the keeper of. Yeah. We currently have three successful participants enrolled here. Okay, now we are playing the man in the suit. So we can only, whoa, this is weird. We can only move diagonally. We have to use two arrows at a time. What the frack? Well, let's go explore. We're at the bottom of the sea. Let's see what we can find. All right, someone boarded up the walkway at the bottom of the ocean, so. It's been a while. I, I haven't strolled around down here in a, in a hot minute. I love how funky he gets with the, the look at him. Whoa, okay, what is that thing? Hello? Oh! Miss Blanc. I favored her very much. She may look dead, but in actuality, she's fighting through a mindscape of her own creation. Will she awaken from her test? Okay, that's me. Well, that was me. There's Miss Bl Yep, there's my torch. Look at that. Ah, shit. I told her she wouldn't need that. Oh, I picked it up, though. Okay, well, I'm, I'm gonna let Miss Blanc uh, sit here and, you know, learn how to breathe underwater. Let's go keep looking around. So whoever I'm playing as now has some sort of knowledge of whatever fucked up shit I'm into at the moment. I managed to break down the boards with the torch. I don't know how the fuck you managed that, bud, but good good for you, let's go. Oh shit. You're diving off the coast of Canada. It's as strange as you remember. It's cold and you're an idiot creature not designed for an ocean. You just sort of float along and it's suddenly dark. You have a light, but you can barely see anything till the beam clips something close, something huge and moving incredibly fast. It's like standing next to a train as it rockets past. And later you dream about it. You're going about your day and you see it in the corner of your eye. It's immense and so much faster than you remember. You try to move, but you just hang there, floating, waiting for it to finally take you. What the fuck? Whoa, what is that? Is that the thing? Oh, uh oh, oh, oh shit. Fight scene, monster stamina. It got me. <laughs> whoa, whoa, come on. Ah! We're dodging them. Attack. We scared it off. <laughs> yeah! Uh, 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 uh. Take that, you ugly ass bottom of the sea anomaly. Okay, let's keep let's keep scrolling. Let's keep digging around down here. All right, let's boogie on to the next place, man. Oh, are these office walls? Oh, three. That's me. Okay, we're inside a building now. Whoa, that is fucking trippy, dude. The edge? Oh, we're in the fucking back rooms, dude. This is literally the back rooms, pre-back rooms. So this is his establishment. He meant to come here. What am I walking on right now? What? This is fucking with my brain so hard. I need to check in on the other participants. Colors. What do they mean? Oh, shit. You don't really see them when you're well, but get sick or start to stumble and you'll find vultures of every kind. Birds, dogs, other people just hovering at the horizon and waiting for you to finally sit down and give up. That's inspirational. It's like those stories you hear about old people dying in their apartments and their own cats eating them. Same thing, vultures. Oh, what is it? Oh, it's a cocky balls. Oh no, it's a, it's a vulture who's f***ing jacked. Oh my God, he killed my ass. Holy shit. Oh, what the f***? Ah! Ah, ah, ah! Okay. Yeah. Wow. We fucked that boy up, turn him into a pile of goop. Okay, let's keep walking. Oh, the little, the little rock piles. This is where I left participant number two. Where have they gone? Oh, participant! Oh, I think we found him. <laughs> oh, shit. Where the fuck is participant number two? What is that? I think this shiny emblem belonged to participant number two. Uh oh. That's not good. Uh, yeah, I think that eagle with anchor arms got to him before I could. Maybe the eagle with, you know, anchor arms is not real, or maybe he's super real, and you should be afraid of him. I have no clue. I hold up the emblem. Even wrapped in dreams, participant two is drawn to it. I see them flying high in the distance. They will be fine. 
<laughs> That's participant number two. Look at that little guy. Get it. Yeah. Go, Jim. Whoa, what's that? Oh, shit, a gun? <laughs> what? Where did this come from? Let's go shoot Jim with it. Hey! Well, let, I won't let me shoot Jim. <laughs> That's unfortunate. Oh, shit. I won't have to worry about that lock anymore. Okay, we shot the door open. It's kind of badass. This is participant number one's room, construct, what have you. So these are definitely constructs. And I probably came from participant three who was Miss Blanc. With the tumbleweed? Oh, hey, participant number one looking good. Oh, God, no, that's, that's an eldritch monster. Fuck! Oh, God, not again. Oh! Holy shit. Ooh, yeah, I think that was participant number one. Uh, oops. <laughs> oh, shit. My, my bad, buddy. Fuck. <laughs> I knew it. I knew it. I killed a participant. So that that's it. My backwards masters will be phasing me out of existence. I feel it happening now. For some reason, my final thought turns to Miss Blanc. Has she woken up? Dude, what? What? That was fucking awesome. This is actually this is getting really interesting now. Okay, so it started with Miss Blanc in the catacombs. Then this guy, who I'm assuming is with the corporation, who is running all of these participants through these trials, through constructs that are made from their fucking brains. Uh, this guy uh, breached protocol and shot a participant in the head, and now he's dead, faced out of existence. Like if I was to talk about the baby, I wouldn't say he uh, faced a guy out of existence at Walmart, but it sounds funnier, so we'll go with that. All right, next we have specimen number. four four which is emerge and i'm guessing that is miss blanc there at the bottom of the fourth uh disc this one's covered in goop there's a watermark for the png of splatter that they used miss blanc will she awake from her tests whoa Okay, we're Miss Blanc. So I'm not sure if this is the test or her waking up, but we'll find out, I guess. Is that, is that another Miss Blanc? Wait, how many Miss, how, God damn, how many bitches named Miss Blanc you be bringing to the crib, bruh? I thought I was the only Blanc. <laughs> this has to be the test. This is not where my ass passed out, bro. Don't get close. Why not? What, what, what happens if I get close, huh? <laughs> Use. Wait a minute. This is the trial. This is a trial, and these are my, my past experiences, I'm guessing. Oh my god, where the f am I? Whoa, yep, there's a bunch of other Miss Blancs. Only the strongest Blanc will survive. I think we made it out? Or at least to the next part. Wait, what? Don't get close. Wait, so is that another me running the trial? I, I'm, I'm gonna stick with that. I think we're... We're seeing past and current attempts. Yeah, she was fucking crushed by an anvil, Looney Tune style. Frank. Goofy ass bitch. POV, I'm doing your mom. That's because you're your mom's your mom's got a big big old coochie. That's why. It's like a portal. Whoa, that's fucking trippy, dude. What the fuck? Let's see where it where it takes us. Oh! That's a big head. God narrator would be going crazy with the puns right now. Oh, I'm the what? Wait, no, I don't, I don't want to crush it. That's me. Please don't make me do it. Oh my God, fine. No. Oh. <laughs> Whoa, what? What? Wait, I'm in the same game. Where the fuck am I? Is this my cell? Pass the test. She passed it. My brain right now is just fucking. Oh my God, fried. So in the same way that patients two and three had two constructs that the other guy that we played as in the suit was able to go through. Miss Blanc was going through her own trials. They had not passed theirs yet, but she just did by crushing a little ant version sized of herself in her hands. Like, okay, specimen five, drip. Congratulations. You aced the test. That scary place is far away now. Miss Blanc will take you home now. Just stay right there. Congratulations! Oh, fuck! Ah! What is happening? Whoa, what? Dude, what in the Mario Galaxy shit is this, bro? I'm playing as this little head fella. Whee! <laughs> Whoa! 
We gotta roll around and collect little orbs and stuff. Whoa, this is so trippy, dude. What the frick? You shouldn't go down there. Oh, f turn around then. Turn around then. You're too cute, really. <laughs> what? Why are, you, why are you flirting with me, dog? Collecting those little things? You'll never wake up. This game's roast is roasting me for being a gamer right now, okay? I see coins. I pick them up. It makes a funny little sound and my brain's happy. Uh oh, I fell. What is that? It's a, a face? Yeah, that's definitely a face. Oh, fuck! Did I just get eated, bruh? That's so hot. Okay. I, I really didn't get anything from that, but that was fucking cool. <laughs> I, I don't know what to, what to take from that. So it seems like Miss Blanc now isn't the focal point. Maybe she's a, a part of it now? Like a part of the, the corporation thing or whoever's running these tests on participants? Next, we have Dream Aether. Okay, Specimen 6 has a, a little disclaimer here. Specimen's contents have been known to sometimes cause subjects to enter a deep and permanent cum. Say what? Put it in, put it in, put it in, put it in! Oh, great. Now you have sunk to the very depths of your consciousness. Ms. Blotch is furious with you now, especially after you did so well in the tests. I made mommy mad. Whoa, man. What the hell, man? This is vibey as fuck, man. I'm just a head floating around and shit. Collect 10 fragments, bro. Make the key. Oh, we got a little boost. That's the permanent cum right there. <laughs> there is no guarantee you will be able to wake up. Is that Cleopatra? Is that Cleopatra from SpongeBob, bro? I'm gonna give this bitch a kiss. Hold up. <laughs> These are the types of dreams you have when you eat all the Flintstone gummies. Get them orbs, baby. Uh, okay, we should have created the key. There it is. Oh, fuck yeah. Uh. You just want to hide in here, right? All you want to do is remain and sleep. Excuse me, ma'am. I just gotta... I just... Uh, oops. Ha uh. <laughs> ha. Oh, the planets up here and shit, bruh. I think if I play this for too long, I'm gonna go brain dead. Whoa, what? If you come back now, then I am sure Mrs. Blanche will forgive you. Man, tell that old dusty bitch, Miss Blanc, I ain't never coming back, bro. This shit's awesome. Oh, yeah, baby. Give me that fucking key, dog. Is that it? Oh, the trick shot. This is it for you now. No going back. No going back, huh? Why wouldn't you listen to me? To Mrs. Blotch? Even with your body back, who knows what will happen next? Wait, who's that? Hey, it's my body! Don't come crying to me after all the horrors you will see. Yep. Smack that head back on. Hey, get it. God damn, that was kind of clean. I thought he was about to start beatboxing. <laughs> Miss Blanche! Me and my homies hate Miss Blanche, man. The game starts you, Miss Blanche. You're a uh, participant in these experiments. Uh, one of the representatives of the company putting you through this, uh, you're a participant of, puts you into your construct to run a test, guides you to the middle of the ocean, leaves you there, sees if you go through the test, you make it out. I'm guessing Miss Blanche became a part of this organization. And the last two games have been about another participant who we haven't formally been introduced yet. And he's saying, fuck you, test man. I'm going to sink deeper and deeper into this thing. Miss Blanche said no head. He said, bitch, what you think? Yeah, you just keep, keep, keep full, full floating, fella. Ooh, 